friends it's rana and as you can see from the thumbnail i am not alone here today i am with some booktuber friends we gathered to play some bookish games let me introduce you to everyone first of all and the most important person the mastermind behind all of this who prepared for this and made it happen is lana from lana x libris she's the one who came up with the idea of the bookish games she's the one who prepared the potential games and she prepared everything. She made this happen today. Then we have lovely Charlotte from Coiny Reads. Next we have Sarah from Sarah's Perusals. Leanne from Leanne Reads. And last but not least, Melina from Melina Reads who couldn't join us today because of some personal issues that came up last minute. The six of us are gathering today to play six different bookish games. Each one of us will host one of these games on her channel. As for me, I am hosting the last one, which is Guess the Book by the Fan Art, which means that we were supposed to have six different bookish games on each of our channels. We played Guess the Book by the First Sentence, Guess the Book by the Fan Art, the Dingbats games. It was so much fun, but unfortunately, we went through some technical difficulties and only my recording and Charlotte's recording of the meeting or the game that we, games that we played survived. So for now, we only have two games to share with you, one on my channel and one on Charlotte's channel. But don't hesitate to check out all of these amazing ladies' channels and encourage them and subscribe to them because they are really amazing readers and they have amazing content on their channel. So go ahead and support them. But keep an eye on our channels because we may or may not try to play another round of these games to share them with you again because we had so much fun the first round. As for today's fan art game, each one of us prepared three different fan arts inspired by three different books. And the rest of us have to guess the book that inspired the fan art. You can play along with us, so keep a score of the points you get. If you guess the book that inspired the fan art from the first try without using any hints or clues, you get two points. And if you guess it after using a hint or a clue, you get one point. A simple rule for a simple game. So let's start the game. Okay. okay. Let's start with Charlotte's. I can take three. Yay. Okay. Yes. Okay. I, I think I've got it. I got it. Perfect choice. Thank you. <laughs> okay. It's also like, if you know my taste it, in books, then you yeah, <laughs> we get it. Do anyone of us mm -hmm. want a hint? Nope. No, I don't know how I until this one. <laughs> okay, shall you reveal the answer? <laughs> uh, so this one is red, white, and royal blue. When... Uh, when they go to the wedding and uh, Prince Henry and Alex uh, have like a little scuffle and then they end up knocking down the like 30,000 pound wedding cake and it causes an international scandal and sensation and this is what kickstarts the plot. It kickstarts the plot because they have to be friends and then they become lovers and it's great. <laughs> I really like this book. I never read it but I heard a lot of it about it so that's why I guessed it right. <laughs> Yay. Okay, next one or okay. We have this one. <laughs> Whoa. Does anyone need some hints? Yes. <laughs> Your biggest hint will be the person right at the front. What's going on there with the face? It's smudged. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Do we have our answers? You ready? Yeah. Yeah. So this one is The Invisible Life of Addie LaRue. Ew. Because Addie's whole thing is that people don't remember her, and even when people take, if you were to take a photo of her, her face would be completely blurred, so she can never make an impression on the world. For some um, reason, I had Discovery of Witches in my head. I don't know why. <laughs> I did not read that book. <laughs> um, other other clues you've got two guys there: um, Luke and what's the other guy's name? I've read this book twice, and I can't remember. Is he called Henry? I 
forgotten his. Um, so there, he could never be remembered. There was another one that I liked better, which had like um, like the seven freckles, which are like constellations on her face, which is how it's described. Um, but I, the, the, there was an actual like written clue in there that I thought I'd be like messing with somebody's fan art if I went and scrubbed it out. Um, and also the clock in the background is symbolic as well. Um, yeah. <laughs> I would never have guessed that. known as the smudged face of the uh, <laughs> I would have never guessed it. <laughs> Looks like Benedict Cumberbatch on the list. <laughs> <laughs> Giving them casting ideas. Uh, yeah, we ready for the next one? Okay, mm -hmm. we have this one. <laughs> Leon's on <laughs> it. Um, oh, what's it called? You you've Aww. definitely seen a cover that would remind you of this. Oh really? Hold on, maybe I've got the wrong one then. <laughs> <laughs> Does anyone aside from me wants a clue? <laughs> I could use a clue. Uh, <laughs> oh god. Um if it's from a very well loved romance book, romance series. Um, that people read on booktube. That's I don't know how else to give a <laughs> clue for it. I don't know which one but of you... the three books is it. <laughs> that's, yeah, that's, that's, yeah. that's probably the hardest bit. That's probably the hardest bit. Okay. If, if you've seen the covers, then you might get it. But <laughs> okay. Are you ready to reveal the answer? I'm ready. Uh, so this one is take a hint, Danny Brown, which yeah. is the second one. In the Brown Sisters trilogy, went for the right I one, guess it's right. <laughs> uh, which is also my favourite one. Um, yeah, it's a bit cute. Those are mine. Excellent. Then we have Melina's. Shall we do hers? Yes. Okay. Do you know the answer, Lana? For this one? La for all of, of Melina's. No. Wait, should I? How shall we know? <laughs> How shall we know? Wow. <laughs> I'm guessing something I don't think it's right. Yeah, I also have a guess, but but also because the dogs look like Lady in the Tramp a little yeah. bit. <laughs> so it's throwing my me off. Well, I sent her a message. We'll see if she replies. Let's do the second one okay. while we wait. Next we have this one. Wow. Can you zoom, oh. it, zoom it in a little bit? Um, oh, thank you. Yes. <laughs> oh, yeah. Go, go, go. Oh, I like that. Um, Charlotte, can I get a hint, please? Oh God! Um, all I'm thinking is, if you've seen the film, then you'd recognise some of the things. But that's not helpful. Um, it's a, a it's cult a classic. Of age. It's a coming of age cult classic. You've definitely heard of it. Maybe one of the like original YA, yeah, novels. Can you read the words on the letter, Lana? It says, "Dear friend, love Charlie." Uh, ah, okay. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Sorry for the scream. I'm a okay, it was great. Okay. Yes. Did all of us guess? Yeah. yeah. Okay. To the next one. Mm. Oh. It's <laughs> just a woman. <laughs> this could be anything. <laughs> Well, her this could clothes, be any gal in a corset. <laughs> this looks not Victorian. This is not Jane Austen era. That's like earlier than that. I would say this is seven, eighteen sixties. I don't know. Which helps no one. <laughs> and I think I've got a guess. What is it? <laughs> <clears throat> I think it's wrong, but I've got to go. We could always go on the artist's Instagram and then scroll. Oh, yeah. and then try and find it. 
Yes. I'm going to do that right now. We can cut this. Yeah, because she was actually a good person and credited the artists, whereas I just steal things. <laughs> Me too. Okay, I found the picture. And it doesn't say who this is. It just says art. Outlander? Outlander. Oh, okay. Oh. I just guessed Tess of the Devils. <laughs> Do we all agree on the answer of the second one? Yes, let's uh, talk about the second one first. Yeah, so Perks being a wallflower. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Look who's here. Oh my god, guest oh. appearance. <laughs> You're muted. You're muted. Okay. We were looking at your art and we have questions. <laughs> yes. Go let's ahead, go back. Okay. Let me go Wait, back yeah. to them. I see you all. This is so strange. I can only see a few of you. Okay, but I'll. You need the answer for this one. Has everyone been able can to? We get... have a hint for this one. A hint. Um, I have read it this year. Like maybe that's a hint for some people. I don't know. <laughs> I have a guess for it, um, but I don't know if it's right. Yeah, I also oh, had a guess, guess, but I don't know. <laughs> Let us hear the guesses. Yes. Um, so I put Wuthering Heights, but I don't think it's right now. I uh, also put Wuthering Heights. <laughs> I put Frankenstein. <laughs> Do I need to confirm anything? Say if it's right. Yeah. It's Wuthering Heights. Yes. Oh, oh. Who is the woman? It, that is Kathy. You have Kathy and then Heathcliff in the middle, and then Linton on the left, and then the dogs they have in the house as well. Oh, because I did think with her heights, but the girl, I did. That's not how I pictured her. That's why. <laughs> I think it's the younger version of Kathy, definitely. Mm. Okay, the next one. I think all of us guessed it right. The perks of being a wallflower. Yes, that's right. Yay! That one's so cute. I like that one. And the last one, we cheated. <laughs> <laughs> but please give Wait. us the right answer. How did you cheat? Ask Lara! I googled the, <laughs> I, I googled the name of the artist. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. We got Outlander. Yeah, that's true. That is Claire from Outlander. Oh. I wasn't sure. I think Sarah, was it Sarah who guessed um, Tess? Du I cannot pronounce I, that I, name. Charlotte. I did Tess of the Debevilles. Oh, that was Charlotte. Yeah. That's a good guess, though. Yay! Thank you. How are you feeling? Are you resting? <laughs> <laughs> I have seen better days. <laughs> But no, I'm I'm fine. Just brain is not functioning, but <laughs> that's all. Hey, neither were ours. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for popping in. You yeah, have fun, girls. <laughs> Bye. Rest up. Bye. 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 Oh, I didn't think she would actually like join us. That's so cute. Okay, let's go to the next one. We have. <gasps> Lana's. Oh! This one is beautiful. Oh. It's so beautiful. Yeah, I like this one. Man, do I even read? You, okay. you know this one, Leanne. Do I? You do. Yeah. Creepy man face. <laughs> Would you like a hint from Lana? I'll take a hint. Mm, I'm thinking how much okay. to give you. Um, it's a it's a painting. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that's a big hint. <laughs> that's a big hint. <laughs> but anything less would be too little. What? <laughs> It's a painting. Hmm. Have I read this book? You know I don't know if you've read it, but you, you'll, you will know it. it. I promise you. Yes. <laughs> I was just there like, 
it's an author from your country. You need to get this one. <laughs> I have read it. And um, it is? The Picture of Dorian Gray. Yeah. Yes. The next one is this little cute guy. Little good guy. Okay. okay. Okay, I think I've got character, but it could be any book in my Ah, uh, it's a, it's a character, a hundred percent character. Okay. I think I got this. I need a clue. <laughs> Sarah, what about you? I have a guess. But the clue is moustache. <laughs> wait, wait, I can do better. Oh, by me too. I forgot I have hair. <laughs> <laughs> also, like, murder. Double clue. Are okay. we ready? Oh, oh. Okay. What? <gasps> I have a really, really weak guess, but tell us the answer. <laughs> Uh, this is Hercule Poirot by Agatha Christie. Well, any book. <laughs> <laughs> what did you guess? No need to know. <laughs> <laughs> what did you guess? So the study in Scarlet for some reason. Okay, same. <laughs> really? Interesting. Yeah, well, I wrote three guesses <laughs> and all of them were incorrect. Wait, I can see that. I can see that. Minus the mustache. I could see that being Watson. In, yeah. In yeah. Yeah. My first guess was Pickwick Papers. Oh, that's oh, a good yeah. one. That's yeah. a good one. I think it also looks like the penguin person from Batman, but that's not a book. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> but that, but the one in Batman look more evil. This one looks yes. so cute. <laughs> <laughs> Next we have. Oh, this one easy. Ah, <laughs> oh, yeah. Charlotte, did you just drink tea or was it a flask? It looked like that was, that was water. Sorry, no. <laughs> it looked like an alcohol. <laughs> yeah, no, no. You're enjoying the games. <laughs> Drown my sorrows in my water. <laughs> Does anyone need any clues? And the answer is the Song of Achilles. Yeah. Yeah. I'm so glad that this book, like everyone knows it by now. Yeah. We all read so differently, but we all know this book. I love that. <laughs> it is a really good book. Yes. Next, we have this one. These are mine. Okay. <laughs> That's written on her shirt. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I think this looks so creepy. <laughs> we need clues. We definitely need okay, clues. Are we are ready for a clue. Yes, yeah. Yes, please. Uh, this book was originally written as fan fiction for a very uh, famous film. Oh, okay. Oh, Wait, wait, no. Um, I think I've got this wrong, but. Okay, I'm, I'm making a guess. Okay. Are we ready? Because if it is this, this is not how I think it's going to feel. <laughs> Are we ready? Yeah. Yes. This is the love hypothesis. Oh, oh. <laughs> I wrote 50 shades of gray. <laughs> yeah, exactly. think, this is not what these people look like. <laughs> I wrote Shadow Hunters. Um, I was looking at it and I was thinking, like, in what book is there like a giant man and a tiny woman? And I've like all of the romance books. <laughs> Every single one. My first thought was just like, this is not Twilight. <laughs> and then I'm lost. <laughs> oh. So the love hypothesis was originally yeah. Star Wars fan fiction. Mm. Oh, that makes sense. My second one is also Ginger Lady Kissing Man. Oh, this <laughs> one. I know this one. 
Uh, yeah. <gasps> I don't know what it's called, but I know it. <laughs> what is it called? <laughs> Do you need a clue? Oh, once again, I'm very confidently put an answer which might be wrong, but yeah. Uh... <laughs> Does I see the cover, want... I just don't have the words. <laughs> Does anyone want a clue? I got the no. answer. <laughs> no one wants okay. a clue? Ugh. No? No. Do we want the answer? Yes. The answer is One Last Stop by Casey McClure. Yes! Oh. I'm counting that as one since I did not guess the actual name, but I guessed the book. Why? So I'm not giving I... myself two points, but one. <laughs> Why did I, for some reason, guess Eleanor and Park? So did I, and I was like, "That's a weirdly problematic book for Leanne to bring up." Yeah, I, oh, I can Eleanor see. Oh, but it does look like Eleanor and Park, doesn't it? <laughs> and I was I so confident. Totally <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. But I have read one last part, so I should have got that. Ah. The next one, we have. <laughs> Absolutely no idea. Uh, I'm guessing something because that's all I've, all I've got to go on. There are so many romances in like libraries and with books. Yeah. I just need to choose one. <laughs> <laughs> Do we want a clue? Yes. This is not a book that's set on a beach. And it's not a book that's set on vacation. <gasps> okay. <laughs> well, now I don't think I know what it is. I thought I knew. <laughs> so it's not on a beach and it's not on a vacation. What other book might it be? <laughs> I love that clip. Oh, no, I am right. I am right. <laughs> <laughs> I think you ready we all for the answer? It. Yeah. Yeah. It is Book Lovers by Emily Henry. <laughs> now for my fan arts. <laughs> okay. The first one is <gasps> too easy. Yes. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> I'm a fantasy lover. <laughs> that's beautiful, actually. Mm. You all guessed, guessed it, right? <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. It is Professor McGonagall. My favorite character. <laughs> Next we have this one. Got it. Oh. I like that. There is so much beautiful fan art. When I was looking for mine, there's just people are so talented. Do you need a hint, Sara? I'm gonna have a guess. Uh, but I will take a hint. It is a uh, historical fiction. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm so stupid. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Shall I reveal the answer? Yes. The book thief. That's like one of my favorite books too. I can't believe that didn't come to me immediately. Sorry. <laughs> the cockiest thing that I have ever done in my life is I typed the book thief and immediately put two next to it. <laughs> <laughs> and my last fan art, it is a little bit hard for non-fantasy readers. Oh. Hmm. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> Do we get anything if we oh, guess no, the man. author? What did you say? Sorry. Do we get anything if we guess the author? No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, guess the series. Okay. Ah, okay. the name of the series. Or well, at least the first book. <laughs> I'm guessing a series, but I know it's wrong, so it's fine. Do you want some clues? Yes, please. Okay, the first one, he is the main character in the series. This character. It is a long-ass series. Unfinished series. I think I might have to. Oh. 
It is unfinished. I need words around. I need words. <laughs> um, mm. If you know the author, you know his unfinished long series? You would think. <laughs> I mean, I'm thinking of an author, but th this is not a character that I would associate with it. So okay. I <laughs> I made a book review for the first and the second box of the series. <laughs> no? Mm, and I watched them too. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Shall I say the author? <laughs> I, I'm pretty sure I know. Okay, yes, yeah, say the author. Brandy Sandy. Brandon Sanderson. Yes. <laughs> but, what oh, no, that's but what series? Oh. Uh, um, Way of King. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that's not the name of the series, is it? I don't. It is the first book. Oh, I don't. Yeah. Okay. I've got a series name then. But I'm not sure if I should get points for that. <laughs> <laughs> I have a name in my head that is absolutely wrong, but it would not will not go away. <laughs> okay. Shall I reveal the answer? Yes. The Stormlight Archive series. Oh, okay, that's not what I thought. Uh, I was not. <laughs> I put this on, but then I thought, is that a long series? I don't know. It is. It will be a 10-book series. So mm. far, four books has been published, and this character is Kaladin. Oh. Mm. I like his style. I like the boots. Okay, next one. Ooh, this like one that. was too hard. <laughs> mm -hmm. No, it's good. It's good. Keep us on our toes. We have oh, so yes. Okay. Yeah. Oh, sorry. I just got into this this year, so I'm really happy. Yeah. Does anyone need a hint? No. No. And the answer is Anne of Green Gables. Yes. Ooh. Next we have. What is this? Oh, 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 yes. Yes, Sarah. <laughs> no, Sarah. <laughs> what the hell is this? Why are they holding so many things? Because <laughs> there are many people. Maybe count the number of people. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> that doesn't help me. No. <laughs> Do you need hints? Mm -hmm. uh, look at the cane in the middle. I think I'm the only one who knows the answer. <laughs> no, no, I know the answer. Oh, you know what? The may I add? Yes. I do not know may answer. I, so. May I add to the clue? Yeah. The the thing you see the, the cane plus the number of people. Got it. You've heard of it. <laughs> yeah, it's got it. You hear it every, like all the time. Don't do think so I? much, Charlotte. Just just say it out loud. <laughs> Let me. This is what I do. <laughs> yeah. No, just, uh, no, I'm a lost cause. Go, go on, go on. It is six of crows. Ah, I was never getting that. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the next one is... Gloomy Lady Collar Man. What's that book? <laughs> okay, I have, a, I have a guess. I need a hint. <laughs> The tree is significant in the book. Question? Yeah. Has this book been mentioned today already? <laughs> yes. Then I know what it okay. is. Okay. Yeah, me too. <laughs> All right, are we ready? In my neck of the woods. Uh -huh. it, it's Jane Eyre. Mm -hmm. That's not what I guess. You guessed Wuthering Heights? You guessed Wuthering Heights? I did too! 
No. I guess they didn't go. Wasn't there also a tree? Wasn't I mean, there a tree? I mainly knew that because I came across that when I was trying to look up fan <laughs> art. So <laughs> complete cheat, really. I was so happy for a second. Okay. <laughs> I think we are done with the fan art. Yay! Yay! Can I share? Can I share you my my other one? It's not for points. I just thought it was funny. Yeah. Oh, yes. Wow. Is it in the bonus material? In the bonus material. Yeah. I just enjoyed this one, so I thought I'd throw it in. <laughs> mm. This could apply to so many books. I have a guess. <laughs> I have no guess. I, I think no it guess. Also makes sense. if you've seen if you've seen the adaptation of this film, then you'd probably get who the character is more. This but it could apply to so many. It could apply to so many men in in books. Yeah, because they're very frustrated all the time. Yeah. Is this Darcy? It is not Darcy. But I it's not the equivalent. Yeah, go on. Uh, Mr. Thornton from North and South. Yes! <laughs> oh! This could apply to so many men. It could! <laughs> I just thought it was fun. Sorry, that is the top hat for me. Because <laughs> he's just like there in a corner, he's like, why doesn't she love me? Why does she love me? <laughs> this is how he spends most of the book, and it's great. In the meanwhile, count your points. I got 19 oh. in that one. I got 18. Mm. I got 15. Um, 14. 18. Oh. Because I either, I either didn't get it, or I got it without a guess, so uh, without a hint, so... Mm. So that's it for today's bookish game. I hope you enjoyed it and had fun along with us because I definitely had fun playing with these lovely ladies. Please tell me in the comments how many points did you get from playing this game? Did you do a terrible job or did you beat all of us? That's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe to see my future videos and I will see you next time. Bye!